Hey guys, today I'm going to show you how to beat Cuphead. Now what you're going to want to use is you're going to want to use the roundabout to get great damage. When he shoots the three bombs, you're going to want to try to dodge it and try and parry the pink one, the pink worm. Now, on the third one it gets faster, and so, yeah. If you use this, you'll get him on the third try. Up next, you're going to want to use the lobber for the onion, because he'll kind of get pretty annoying. You're going to want to make sure you dodge the tears, too. And try and parry the pink ones. And finally, you're going to want to use the roundabout for the carrot. Now, you're going to want to make sure you watch out for the carrots, so don't forget to aim at them. Next, if you have, you're going to want to try to dodge the side beams that he shoots at you. Then, use your Super Art 1 to do a devastating attack. Then just keep shooting at him with your normal gun. Don't forget to dodge the carrots. And you're going to want to keep doing this until that happens. Well, that's it for my video, and I'll see you guys later. Hey guys, welcome to another Cuphead Guide. Today, I'm going to be showing you how to beat Goopy LeGrande in Ruse of the News. Now, what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to use the roundabout to get damage on him. Make sure you cook that smoke bomb. Now, if you're close to him and he tries to punch you, you're going to want to duck underneath. Or, in other words, try to get away from him. Now, the smoke bomb is good, just in case. Now, when you see that happen, it's time for a second form. Try and parry all the question marks as you can. Now, you're going to want to try to dodge him because he's really big. Be careful. Don't forget to duck underneath his punches. You're going to keep doing this. Now, when he does that, then that means he's almost done. When that happens, you're going to want to use your super art straight away to get good damage. Or, if you don't have it, then just use that. Now, when he tries to slam, you're going to want to dash away from him as quick as you can. Keep doing this until he finally dies. Like that. Thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you later. Hello guys, welcome to a Cuphead Guide, and I'm going to show you how to beat Cagney Incarnation. Now what you want to kind of do is you want to try to get a few shots with the lobber. After that, switch with the roundabout. Don't forget to parry those flowers, or else that the annoying one is going to get there. Try to kill it as fast as you can. Next is his second phase. When he shoots the carrot, try to dodge them. The boomerang goes on both ends, the bottom and the top. Now, when he does that, you're going to want to go beneath the platform. He'll go underneath, too, so you'll want to go on top. Try to kill the ones that are trying to kill you first. Now, for the next form, you're going to want to use your super straight away. Now, you want to make sure you don't touch the ground, because if you do, then you're going to be in lots of trouble. Don't forget, you can parry the pink things. Next, you're going to want to try to dodge the vines, because they're going to try to come on there beneath the platforms. Don't be afraid to use any specials. And there you go. That's how you beat connect. See for more. Hey guys, today I'm going to show you how to beat Hildeberg. Now, you're going to want to dodge the purple things, because they're going to try to shoot bullets at you. Now, for Hildeberg, you're going to want to keep dodging the Haas until she goes to her next form. Now, try to get away from her as fast as possible. For the goat, when you see her stand in a specific spot, you're going to want to get away from her, as you can see. She's going to do this four times. Next, as soon as she goes back into her form, you're going to want to use your bomb so you can go straight to the next form. You're going to want to keep doing this until that happens. Now, when she turns into this, this is going to be one of the toughest that I do. 
You're going to want to try to dodge the stars because they're going to try to follow you. Don't forget to dodge the bullets too. She's going to do this three times in a row. So you're going to want to be careful. Or that depending on how long it takes or how long you shoot. Now, for that, when she finished doing that, two purple ones are going to try to shoot you. So you're going to want to try to at least get rid of one. Now, when she reaches this stage, means that she's finally done for the final stage. Now, for this, you're going to go straight as soon as you can to the boss to, so you can get some more damage in. Now, for the UFOs, if you can see the beam, you're going to want to try to dodge the point of the beam. So it could go up, it could go behind. Just make sure you dodge it. Don't forget to focus on the stars, too. And there you go. That's how you beat Hildeberg.